Hey guys and welcome to Drastic Productions first ever tutorial. Um, I'm Drastic and uh, let's go. First of all let's click MoGraph, choose a text object. Write anything, whatever you prefer. I'm just gonna go with Drastic, change the font. I'm gonna go with Champagne Limousines. Mm, click Align, go Middle. And then let's go caps, add a fillet cap on both. Let's make it 10 and 2, 10 and 2. Click constrain. Uh, yeah, I guess that's it. So, uh, you could, by the way, you could uh, go ahead and make it deeper. I'm gonna go 80. Yeah, let's go 80. Looks good. Thick, nice. So, what you want to do now is go to this one, choose an arc, and down here, choose 180%, hit enter, uh, let's scale it up, let's make it, whatever, let's make it 700, there we go, uh, uh, click reverse, it's important, otherwise uh, the letters will fly into each other. You'll see. Click the text, MoGraph, uh, choose a spline effector, uh, letters, spline effector, yep. Click the spline effector, you see here, and sp at spline, take this one and drag it into here, okay? And now we get to this. You can change the strength, and we've got, you know. Um, let's see. Let's go here to rotate. Hold Shift and rotate, and you will go by steps by five degrees. Make it like uh, 75. Let's move the spline back a little bit. Let's move it to 1,000. Let's see, click here, add a camera, then you want to click this little square to make you look through the camera. Rotation 0, 0, position X, 0, Y, mm, let's make it 80, 60. Let's see, yep, looks good. Uh, then you want to click this key. It adds a keyframe. Oh, by the way, let's add a keyframe to 60. Scroll back a little bit. Mm, keyframe it again. And now the camera will move forward. It's magic. So, let's. This plan effector, 100%. Hold control and click this little button. It will make it turn red. After 30 frames, down to zero, hold control, click. And now it'll do like this. Boop. Wee, boop. Choose the text, MoGraph, delay effector, go to uh, effector mode, spring, strength, make it 75. And now, Doing, doing, doing. The text will bounce. Let's light the scene. Uh, yeah, this will do. Let's make a material for the text. Shoes, white, reflection. 13, add a Fresnel, 14, drag it onto the text, and here we go. Whee! I'm just gonna make a quick render so that we can see it. Whoops, sorry about that, guys. Uh, I'll put frame to 100. Oh, let's make it 90. Let's make it. Now, let's see. Yes, I wanna see it. camera 
press zooms in and then it stops. Looking good. Okay, so let's see, let's zoom in a little bit. There you go. How to make a text fly in. Ta-da!